Yeah, it's starting off to be a beautiful day today. Maybe a little bit of rain, rain lingering to our north as that area of low pressure uh, slides up into Canada. So it's going to take that moisture with it. Still a little bit of haze out there, but that should not be an issue for our area uh, through the weekend. Maybe eastern side of Montana down into Wyoming. With the uh, short draw fire, we could still see some uh, smoke impacting the air quality. But for the most part, we're looking pretty free and clear with that air quality for the general population across the weekend. So a nice break there. Yesterday, with the passing of that cold front, it got cool. We were, uh, only got up to about 68 degrees, so a good 8 degrees below the norm. Our overnight low just a little milder than normal. How much rain did we get off of this system? Well, yesterday, 3 tenths of an inch altogether. Uh, the two day event, we got four tenths of an inch of rain, very beneficial, so helped to make a dent, a bit of a dent uh, for the monthly total. We're still just slightly below average for the month, still way behind for the year. Now we're into a stretch of dry weather now for here in Billings, mainly through Monday. But as we get into Tuesday, Wednesday, another system is going to come through. That's going to give us a chance of rain those days. Then another cold front comes through on Thursday. That's going to just keep that chance of uh, moisture in the forecast. And we're going to see another cool down after seeing some warmer temperatures as we get into the weekend. But today looking pretty good with those temperatures, 60s and 70s. We'll see some 80s across the weekend into the early part of next week. And then with two rounds of cold fronts coming in next week, knocking those temperatures back down again.